today we're going to be talking about fasting, the approach and how we're going to do it, especially on a fat loss journey to speed up the process and just get the real benefits from it. So intermittent fasting combined with real food is the key to ultimate health. Now, there are a few ways you can fast and I've done them all. So I'll be explaining about the benefits, drawbacks and my general overview of the whole process. So it's all about your mindset and looking at fasting in a totally different way to benefit you and to progress quicker. So why? Now, when we embrace fasting guys and enter a state of ketosis, a remarkable transformation occurs in our brain function. We can introduce fasting to shock the body and force it to start utilizing stored fat for energy, promoting fat oxidation, essentially. So you see the majority of people store more of the calories that they're consuming in their fat cells compared to their muscle cells. So if we fast, it can also help flush out dead cells and generate new healthier cells in the body and improve insulin and leptin sensitivity. So basically allowing your muscles to soak up every nutrient when we eventually break the long period of fasting. And you're probably wondering how we do it. So fasting can be done in a few ways. So the first way is fasting until 12 midday, only drinking water. So basically closing the eating window we have from the moment we wake up to the moment we go to sleep. So essentially you can miss out potentially up to 500 to a thousand or one and a half thousand calories from just missing um, food and onboarding and consuming uh, whole foods up until 11 a.m. and 12 midday. So the second way is fasting for 24 hours, only having water, fruit or veg. So you can have your shakes, you can eat fruit in its normal form. Either way, it will work and you probably only have, I'd say 200 to 400 or even 500 calories worth of fruit and veg in the day. So you, you can imagine if you're getting your steps in and you're making sure that you're still doing your workouts, your expenditure is gonna be sky high and your calories consumed is gonna be absolutely almost at zero. So you, you, know, you are utilizing that fat, that body fat that is stored energy. And the third way of doing it is fasting for 48 hours or longer. Same again, um, only having water, fruit, or veg. So these different ways of fasting are totally dependent on your goals, your fitness journey, work and family life commitments and the mental headspace you are in. But also if you feel up for the challenge and you want to speed up the process of losing body fat, but also cleansing the body as well, that's quite an important one. So the exciting bit, but I might babble on, but it's just information that I want you to, to listen to and take on board. And these are the real benefits from fasting. So it may improve blood sugar levels. So fasting helps lower blood sugar levels by boosting insulin sensitivity, which is what we want. This can help improve your body's ability to efficiently use insulin. That's when your food is being digested. It's a hormone uh, that's responsible for regulating your blood sugar levels. This may aid conditions like pre-diabetes and type two diabetes. This is an obvious one. So can increase and speed up weight loss. Water and fruit fasting can lead to weight loss and fat loss. It can also help break weight loss plateaus by triggering ketosis. So that's a metabolic state in which body burns fat for fuel instead of sugar, which, you know, when we digest food, it turns into sugar, which is energy. So remember, we want to tell the body to use stored energy that is around our circumference of his body. Now, over time, over the years, if you've eaten more than what you've been burning as in movement, you're going to store that on your body, hips, waist, legs, thighs, back, chest, and you know, this way it is amazing to speed up the process and say, look, we're not giving you food as energy. You need to take the energy that's around the body um, to get going, to get moving, to do workouts and so on. So in one very small study, 
participants lost on average of over 13 pounds and experienced significant reductions in body fat after completing an eight day water and fruit fast. So this is a very big task and goal, but you can imagine the progress we can make if we just did a small 24 hour or even 48 hour fast. So I'm not asking you to do um, long periods of five to seven days of fasting, but if we do 24 hours, 48 hours, you're gonna see a big, big difference in your physique, your mindset, and the benefits that it's gonna to cause to your body. And the third one is it promotes autophagy. So this process occurs when the body begins to clean out old and dysfunctional cells, making way for the generation of new, healthier cells into your body. So research suggests that autophagy has shown signs to help slow aging and increase longevity. Now that is a tricky word, but I've uh, made sure before I did this video that that is how you say it, um, autophagy. Uh, so if you want to tell anybody else, you can. Um, so moving on to can help protect heart health. So uh, one 2021 review reported that water and fruit fasting could significantly reduce blood pressure levels in people um, with hypertension or high blood pressure. So that's a big one in itself. So if you do suffer with that, fasting could be the, the way forward for you to, to test it out and see how it does respond with your body. Um, so can improve insulin and leptin sensitivity. Insulin and leptin are important hormones that affect the body's metabolism. So insulin helps the body store nutrients from the bloodstream, which when you're eating food, you want your macros to be delivered efficiently. And that is what helps nutrients get into the bloodstream and get delivered properly, while leptin helps the body feel full. So when we're eating good quality sourced grass fed whole foods, you want to feel full on these foods. If you're eating processed shite, your hunger will go through the roof. You'll eat it, it won't fill you up, but you'll get another urge in an hour or half an hour to eat more and more. So this is why it's important. Uh, fasting can improve insulin and leptin sensitivity. And fruit cleanse for detox and purification. So fruits contain not only many vitamins, but also minerals, fiber, and enzymes. The enzymes also have a stimulating and strengthening effect on the liver, which is an important organ in the body, in combination with the higher water content of the fruits, which contributes towards the cleansing and of the intestines. They stimulate elimination and detoxification and purification. So that's what it's going to stimulate all of those three things right there. Another massive benefit to fasting. Now, obviously fasting shouldn't be done for 14 days. You know, the way that I do it with certain clients is we do it for 24 hours. See how we get on. Shall we do it for 12 hours or even less just for four or five? See how your body responds. If it responds really well, you feel good. Then we move on to the next stage of right 24 hours. 48, do you fancy 72 for a total cleanse and so on. So strengthening the body and mind. So fruit fasting not only strengthens the immune system, but also your self-confidence. You train your self-discipline and you'll notice that you can endure a day or two of fasting. So when it comes to this, if you can complete a fast, you can do bigger things. You can do massive workouts. You can go for four weeks of intense program, um, you know, just really dialing in. So that is a big, big one right there. Um, lasting motivation, which is similar to what I've just gone through. So in addition to all these benefits to your health and your mind, fasting with fruit also looks and tastes great. So the motivation can be maintained for longer periods. So if you're making good smoothies, if you're making good shakes, you're eating fruit and you enjoy it, you can do this for longer periods of time and eventually really cleanse the body to, to you know, the levels that you wouldn't have thought were possible. And last but not least, easy integration into everyday life. So fasting with fruit is suitable for specific tox, um, detox sorry, days, which can be easily integrated into your day or your week. So similar to the 5-2 the intermittent fasting method, 
you then eat a normal balanced diet for five or six days and only fast on fruit and vegetables on the remaining days. So just say if you wanted to do Monday to Friday, normal whole foods. And if you wanted to do a fast on Saturday, potentially Sunday, but you might just go back on whole foods. That's 24 hours. If you do that once a week, I can guarantee you're going to see massive uh, changes to your body and, and your mindset as well. So I just I just want to make sure that I go over the negatives as well, because there will be some negatives. Most of the clients that I've worked with and myself generally don't get the below uh, negatives, but it's important just to mention them as well. So there are always going to be positives and negatives to anything we do in life, but just be aware that you may or may not experience these symptoms. So dizziness, um, fatigue, and a little bit of brain fog. Uh, I haven't had this personally. I think maybe one had a little bit of brain fog, but they went out on a weekend. So you can, yeah, you can really imagine that you know, he didn't eat, he, he drank, and then he felt like shit the next day. So just be aware of that. Let's not be uh, be stupid. So last but not least, um, my personal experience. So I've done 24 and 48 hour fasts, and they've worked wonders for me. So energy levels, feeling leaner, losing body fat, my scale weight coming down. I actually felt energized and overall that cleansed the body and it truly does work. It's not just some fad that you see online or Instagram and, and so on. Um, I've had all positives from fasting. All clients who I've worked with have seen massive benefits and would recommend anyone to try it and experience it for themselves to gauge an idea of what fasting is actually truly like. If it doesn't work for you, then at least you, you know, you've tried it and that's it. So yeah, if you have any questions, I hope this slide gives you a little bit of info on fasting, how we can do it. If it does interest you, message me um, and then we can implement it into your program. But I just want you to read this, take it all in, all the information, the education and even do research yourself. But yeah, if you want more info, just drop me a message.